Hello everyone. Welcome to Cozy Reading Night with Nova. So first step of Cozy Reading Night of course is to uh, build your own bed so that you have a place to be cozy in. So I built this this afternoon <laughs> and so now I'm definitely ready for three hours of just lying down and reading. Um, you may notice that there's a little swoop to the bed. Um, that's because the mattress is is too big for the bed frame. Oops. Uh, so maybe we'll decide that this worked best. Um, if not, we'll just get like an actual box spring that fits. Because as I learned, American and European mattress sizes are different. So we got a European mattress with an American bed frame. So here's everything that I'm going to need for tonight. I've got my book untold. Um, I have about 80 pages left, so that's not going to take me the whole time. So when I finish, I'm going to switch to Jane Eyre, which I'm reading the Project Gutenberg text of. Um, then I've got my waffles, which are a Dutch candy thing. They're like these waffle cookies with syrup in the middle. It's delicious. Uh, I have a new candle. It is baked apple scented. And then I got some Bailey's which I will be adding to the hot chocolate that I drink later tonight. So I am in um, the Central European time zone, so I'm one hour ahead of uh, Lauren. So um, I am doing the readathon on her time zone, so that's um, 8 to 11 my time and uh, 7 to 10 her time. Um, uh, I, pr I probably wouldn't normally do it this way because normally I don't stay up till 11. But today, I don't know if you can hear, um, there is a carnival going on outside my house. It, I think it's supposed to stop at 11, but it always goes on past midnight, so I, I'm not going to be going to bed that early anyway, so might as well stay up till 11 reading. And now, it is, I have one minute left, so I'm going to go assume the position. Hey guys, we are now about an hour in, and I have... 30 pages to go in Untold. I've also made myself some hot chocolate, boozy hot chocolate, with Baileys in it. Mmm, creamy. And you know, we call this cozy reading night, but I feel like for me, it's sleepy reading night. This is my third one. <laughs> have, I, have I ever made it to the end? I think I always just give up and close my eyes and curl up in bed. I get a little too cozy at the cozy reading night, and I'm like, you know, I could just, I just could not even read. I could just close my eyes and be asleep. So I'm revising my plan to screw Jane Eyre. I'm not going to try to read that. I'm just going to try to finish this book, and then whenever I finish that, I'm going to go to bed, even though it's so loud outside. <sighs> so we have now moved on to the pajama and bathrobe portion of the evening. It is 10.27, and I've finished Untold. Um, I can't really tell you anything about it, because it's the middle book in a trilogy, so spoilers abound. And I'm not feeling as exhausted as I thought I might be, but I still think I'd rather just close my eyes than read Jane Eyre. I have nine chapters left, so I can't finish it tonight. If I thought I could finish it tonight, I might finish Jane Eyre. But you'll have to wait till tomorrow. When I have another readathon, Dewey's 24 hour readathon, see you then.